watching the news summary on Jio.tv. I'm Sharpana Javeri. The Supreme Court issued an interim order in the Balochistan Law and Order case today, declaring the provincial government and the FC's missing persons report unsatisfactory. The IGFC told the court that clear orders have been given about carrying weapons, stating that no one must be spared. To which the Chief Justice replied that people are walking around with weapons on Raisani Road. The hearing has been adjourned till Saturday and the Supreme Court has summoned Defence Secretary and the Interior Secretary for the hearing. The Sindh People's Local Government Ordinance 2012 has been implemented in the province after being promulgated by the Sindh Governor Ishad Libad. The new system will be functional in five districts of the province, which will include Karachi, Hyderabad, Sakhar, Larkana and Mirpur Khas, while the remaining parts of the province will have district councils. MQM Chief Altaf Hussain says the enforcement of the new local government system is a big achievement of the democratic government, while the ANP, dissatisfied by the ordinance, has called an emergency session of the party today. SP investigation Jamil Kakar, who was scheduled to appear before the court for the hearing of the Balochistan Law and Order case at the Quetta Registry, was killed when unknown persons opened fire on him. Unidentified persons opened fire on Kakar early this morning, injuring him severely. He later succumbed to his injuries. Indian Foreign Minister S.M. Krishna is scheduled to arrive in Pakistan today for a three-day official visit. The Indian Foreign Minister will hold talks on all issues with his Pakistani counterpart Hina Rabani Khar in the capital city during his visit from September 7 till September 9.